After a very busy spring getting ready for the upcoming summer, we've welcomed six new volunteers over the past week, with many more arriving soon to help with the upcoming season. I've been coming to Orca Lab since 2017, and over the past few years I've taken on the role of uh, overseeing the lab throughout the summer and coordinating the training of the new volunteers. There is a lot that goes into it, and uh, many different elements to what we do here. What we're trying to achieve here at Orca Lab is to fully understand the movements of the whales as they move through the area day and night. Our main tool to do this is our network of hydrophones, which we're listening to 24 hours a day, seven days a week. When volunteers first arrive, they might know the whales, they might know what they look like, they might know who their families are, but very few arrive with an understanding of what they sound like. It takes a lot of dedicated effort and time to fully interpret and understand what it is that we're hearing and how to successfully track different groups as they move through the area. The Northern residents have an intricate social structure and we like to run workshops to help volunteers understand how the society works uh, by telling stories, by showing photos, by talking through each individual family and then matching that to specific calls. One thing that's really important is to make sure that every volunteer is recording data in a consistent manner. Over the course of the summer we might see up to 20 different people here, but it's imperative to make sure that we're recording in a clear and consistent way, so that five years from now we can look back and understand exactly what has gone on at any given moment. The key is to try and keep everyone focused on collecting data and getting great footage for our online audience, whilst also enjoying this incredibly humbling experience. Right now, we feel very prepared and we can't wait for the Northern residents to arrive. Thanks WDC for all your support.